Yo, what's up YouTube? Grady here with Grady's Gear. And today I got an unboxing for you guys. Just uh, chilling here, drinking me some coffee. I'm out running errands today, trying to get some Christmas shopping done. Do not go to Walmart during the day on a Saturday around holiday season. Holy shit. There's not even no buggies in the damn store. So, yeah. Word of advice, don't go to Walmart on your uh, <laughs> on Saturday. Ah, there we go. So, unboxing knife for today is the uh, F5.5 Urban EDC Supply. I got this on the last drop that they did a while back. And uh, this thing's been freaking sweet. This one's the green micarta. You can see my hands were wet from the drink. It's soaking up in that micarta. It takes on a really cool patina. Moving forward, if I would have got one again, it would have been the natural micarta. I'm not a big fan of this green micarta on here. But uh, this is a freaking awesome knife, though, guys. So, this package is coming from Fitch Knives. They were kind enough to send this out to me to check out. And uh, I am super stoked for this. You guys have seen me review a ton of Finch knives in the uh, in the past, and uh, I love everything that they do. I love what they're putting out. This one in particular, I was definitely interested in because of the blade shape. Personally, when I seen it in pictures, I think this is like the sexiest Finch to date. I really like the design element of the 1929 and the Holiday, but this one. Oh, man, this one I, I think is even sexier. I just, I freaking love it. So, keep life from getting dull. Standard Finch packaging. I love their packaging. And this is the one I have. This is the Drifter in Snakewood. 154 CM satin and stone finish. This thing is going to be sweet. Now, at the filming of this video, guys, they are not available yet. I think they are going to be released in like a week or two. So they are coming soon, so if you're interested in this, they will be available very, very soon to purchase on here. So, But I do know they came out with uh, a micarta version as well, but that snake wood just looked freaking epic in pictures, and I had to check it out. Flipping the Finch, standard on your packaging with this sticker right here. What's cool is that they give you a sticker depending on what model that you get. So I got the Drifter, you get this sticker right here. And if you don't know, each model has a design inspiration. It's got its own little story, which is really, really cool. So check out their website for that. I will leave a link to Fitch Knives down below. You get your warranty and you get your Band-Aid. And I have used their Band-Aids before cutting myself. So let's check out the drifter <whistles> that snake wood is sexy let's check out the centering dead nuts on the centering you got a titanium milled pocket clip right here that looks epic let's see how she flips Detent is perfect. Look at that blade shape, guys. Look at this clip point. That beautiful swedge on there is just epic. To me, this is something like James Bond would carry. Just that kind of elegant, sexy kind of knife. You know, he's in Casino Royale and he's got this in his suit pocket. That blade shape is just killer. It is a liner lock. Let's check out the disengagement. Okay. God, it flips amazing. There we go. So it does need to break in just a, just a smidge. There we go. Oh, look at this design. Look at that. Look at that. That is some beautiful snake wood. I just think the snake wood looks amazing on this. You got two barrel spacers right here, standoffs. The other cool thing about Finch knives is when you flip it open, 
this jimping right here doubles as like a choil to put your hand to choke up on, which on this knife feels absolutely fantastic. I can't get over the detent. The detent on this one is fan freaking tastic. Let me see if I can get it to fail real quick. Nope. It's definitely like a push button. And it just rockets out. I could see wearing this at like a wedding or a formal event with a suit. It's very lightweight. And it's got, it looks like brass around that pivot collar which looks really cool. As you can see, they're insignia right here. This is filled with loom, so it will glow in the dark, like, like on a watch, which is really brad. Give you guys some macro shots of this thing. Let's look at this blade. You have their logo right there. Flip it over. Just a sexy, sexy blade. They have come out with some other models recently, guys. Uh, the Cherry Bomb just came out not too long ago. And I believe the Harvester just dropped like a few days ago. So those are available now. If you want to check those out as well. This one was one that I was definitely interested in. I'm so glad I got this into the collection of my little finch nest that I got going on. Finch was one of the first knives I reviewed when I started YouTube, and they've been extremely supportive of the channel over here, so huge shout out to Spencer and Steven with Finch Knives for sending this to me to check out, to share with you guys. Just an epic piece right here. It's just really pretty. So yeah, guys, real quick video. I had a few minutes, and I wanted to share this unboxing with you guys. This is the Finch Knives Drifter. A new offering from Finch Knives, and it should be released within the next week or two. If you want one of these, I'll leave the link in the description below to Finch Knives, and you can go and pick one up for yourself, guys. That's going to do it for this one, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing. I hope you guys have a fantastic day, and I will see you guys in the next one.